I don't know if y'all ever had friends you hung out with, and I believe this director might be one of them, uh, where you, you, you know, you, just, you got somebody you're watching a movie with, and when it's done, they look at it like, man, you know, I was cool, but needed more karate. <laughs> no matter what the f- you're watching. 12 years a slave. You know, them, phrase, them, them slaves would have been freed. They knew karate. Schindler's List, Jews would have been freed. They knew karate. That's true. Now, they, 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 they did Krav Maga. That's what they invented. <laughs> that is true. That's a Jewish yeah. martial arts yeah, right there. Yeah. And if they knew it at the time. Yeah, if they knew it at the time. They'd be free. <laughs> yeah, man. And this is another situation where the direct now, in this case, is jujitsu. But that's what the director did. The, the director got through watching Predator and said, you know what? That was cool, man. But need, a, need, need a more martial arts. Need a more people kicking the shit out of each other. Also... You know, while we, I'm, let's not stop there. Let's throw in some. Uh, let's throw in some Mortal Combat. Yes. Throw in, <laughs> Very let, much let's so. throw a dash of Star Wars in there <laughs> in the dumbest way. Let's throw in some superhero stuff, and just to make sure that we're respecting cinema, let's put in just a pinch of Apocalypse Now. Mm. It's all in there, people. Now, whether it, it makes sense or not, is good. Well, you know, that depends on you. Uh, it's as crazy as it sounds, but I don't know if it's actually good. Uh, you know, there's so many things to question here that they don't really seem to give a shit about. I don't make sense. I, I feel like we can take good <clears throat> off the table. Yeah, that, that's gone. Yeah, but, yeah. but the, what it comes down to then is, is it understandable and is it entertaining? Those are the things we got to focus on here. Well, entertaining, that can be debatable because, you know, that is always subjective. You know, that's a matter of opinion. Uh, whether it makes sense, fuck no, it doesn't make no sense. No, <laughs> yeah. no. It's Nicholas Cage. I was trying what? to hold some suspense, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> we can remove that one also. Yeah, it don't make no goddamn <laughs> sense. It's, uh, this fucking movie's in a fucking loony bin, man. <laughs> It doesn't mean, I, mean, I mean, I made more to, in front of Mortal Kombat because they were like, the fate of the world will be decided by a, a karate tournament. <laughs> <laughs> and this movie said, like, you ain't seen nothing. No, yet. you ain't seen <laughs> Hold my beer. No, this don't make no sense at all. An alien that comes back here every six years to just pick a fight with one dude hanging out in the jungle of Asia. But oh, you, and it don't, and it don't even stop there, you know. You got to have six fighters. Yeah, so. But if you don't fight him, he kills everyone he in kills, the village. Yeah, it just don't make any sense. They, they add more rules as it goes along. And they have Nick Cage to do the, all, all the exposition. I'm like, wait, why didn't you mention this before? This doesn't make any goddamn sense. Yes. Well, what the yeah. story that you have here, it don't make any sense because this alien comes down to pick on these this, this base in Burma. So this must be in the 80s, but that don't make any sense. I mean. I, you know, they never explain what is so special about this these uh these soldiers, and if they and the dude is coming down every six years, you got six years to prepare to beat this <laughs> man. You don't have a bomb waiting at the portal. When he comes <laughs> right. up. You don't. You don't have a wily e. coyote cannon pointed at the, at the portal when he call a bear trap. Something, something, man, anything. I mean, these dudes just sitting on their, on their asses, just waiting. Like, oh shit, here he come again. I hope, I hope it ain't me he pick. <laughs> It don't make it don't make any sense. And then out there, and they don't explain this at all. Out there in the middle of the jungle, these soldiers don't even know about these monks, uh, these the, this this tribe of of of, of martial art experts, jujitsu experts. Who it's their job to protect Earth from alien attacks, which they're doing a pretty shitty job at it. Because every time, <laughs> let on they, and they're led by led by Frank Grillo, who. I don't know if he knows martial arts or not, but he tries and get his ass promptly whooped. Yeah. Oh yeah, he, 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 he talks a big game. Yeah, but. yeah, yeah. yeah. He, yeah takes he, quick. He, he throws knives, which get intercepted and used on his team. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, did they ever like multiple times? And he's just sitting there like, ah, oh, dang, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> there's, there's so many moments in here where. Uh, it don't make any sense, you know, and I don't understand because every time uh, the the alien fights these uh, these these monks or these these this tribe or whatever, they're here to protect the earth from the this this for, to protect earth from aliens, aliens, alien attacks. Mm-hmm. They can't even stop one. Every time this dude comes down, he wipes them out, all of them, all every single one of them. I'm like, well, y'all are doing a pretty shitty job. At protecting the earth and why y'all don't get together with the army and y'all work together to defeat this this was a big thing for me because one this alien seems to want has some kind of honor code and wants to have a fair fight yeah yet 
he has all kinds of crazy superpowers, being able to turn invisible, teleport, shooting ninja stars. Despite his skill, he's got super strength. And so the, the idea is like, okay, well, you have these, these six fighters. Why don't they just team up and all fight him at the same time? Why don't they? But, Why then, they? but then at one point, it's like, oh, he has to fight you individually. But then it's sometimes they do team up. So it's like, I, I don't get this. And it's like, so what if you have to fight him individually? F*** him. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> we, didn't, we didn't want this game. Right. He came right. out here starting this. Yeah. We don't have to play by his rules. Exactly. Brax the alien. <laughs> I'm going to talk about Brax's stupid ass in a little bit. Because, you know, look. As we were talking about with Mortal Kombat and other things, look, we've seen movies where they like, we don't care, man. You know what? We, we know what we're doing. It's, it's, a, it's a thin premise to get fighting going. Yeah, exactly. We just want to do some special effects and fighting, and we, we don't care. You know, we know what y'all are saying. We just putting this stuff together just for cool images and, and whatever, and fights and whatever else we got in there. Uh, so this could all possibly be cool. I ain't nitpicking, but it, it ain't got the budget for it. No. That's the thing, yeah, you know. That, and, and, that's true. And they are, and they are happy to let you know that they, they are they, broke as fuck. They are weighing over their heads, <laughs> right in with the their opening ambition. Too.